All new at 11, CBS 46 investigates a judge's fateful decision to not send this man directly to prison. He is now a fugitive. He's wanted for murder. U.S. Marshals say Richard Merritt killed his mother. That was hours before he was to begin serving 15 years in prison for stealing money. We sent the CBS 46 Bulldog to find the judge who sentenced Merritt and gave him two weeks of freedom. Chief Investigator Jonathan Carlson shows us what happened at the courthouse. For more than two weeks, Richard Merritt has been on the run. We are scared. We've been hiding. That's we Merritt's ex-wife this week, the family under the protection of U.S. Marshals. The former Cobb County attorney given a 15-year prison sentence for swindling clients, now wanted for stabbing his elderly mother to death before disappearing. He destroyed us with what he did. One might argue the 44-year-old would not have been able to commit the alleged crime or vanish had the judge at his sentencing, Robert Flournoy, not granted Merritt about two weeks to get his affairs in order before turning himself in to serve that sentence. That decision is now painfully under the microscope. The bulldog heading to Merritt's attorney's office to get answers as to how this could have happened. He refused comment. Next stop, the Superior Courthouse in downtown Marietta, where we had some questions for the judge himself. I'm trying to reach uh, Judge Flournoy. Is he in? I was told he was in a judge's meeting, so we waited. Hours later, after hearing whispers inside the office, we were told to contact someone else and never got to see the judge, whose decision appears to have had real-life consequences. He didn't have to answer to us, but he might have to answer to the Georgia Judicial Qualifications Commission. They investigate judicial misconduct, but there is no evidence yet of actual misconduct. The commission hasn't said if they'll open an investigation. I'm Jonathan Carlson, the CBS 46 Bulldog.